Um, it, it's amazing. It, it's been a, it's been a long process, but it, you know it's been a journey for all of us, and we really are family by this point. But it's it's amazing to be back here a year later, and the fans still be here. It, it continues to blow our mind every time. No, I mean it's insane. After three and a half years, it's just completely crazy. I didn't even think it'd be like this with the first one. Obviously, no one thinks the reaction to that movie is going to be like this, but it's pretty insane. It's so much better to share it with people. I mean, to do something on your own is just not a shared experience. Is better and. And I share it with people that are genuinely my best friends, and so it's kind of the coolest thing that I get to do. I, Edward Cullen, take you, Bella Swan. For better or for worse. To love. To cherish. As long as we both shall live. No, she looks incredible. I mean, she like it's a really sweet scene. She, like Kristen was terrified about doing it, and so. You, know, you kind of felt, you kind of feel like you have to sort of do something <laughs> at the other end. I think I remember it in the most realistic way. I remember anything I've done in the series. Like, I didn't want to, rem I didn't want to remember neuroses. I didn't want to remember choices or weird actory thoughts. Like, I just wanted to walk down the aisle and actually have the experience. And it felt ceremonial in a really odd way. It was, it was awesome. Huge moment. I mean, it's been built up for so long. So it was, it was great to see Kristen in the dress, Rob in the suit. It's it, the fans are going to love it. Get ready. They're coming for Bella. They're not gonna touch her. If you kill her, you kill me.